Alrighty, let's play this in full. There is sound. There you go. And there we go. And it loops. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna turn off that sound. And it's cute. I like it. I like the portal idea. It's actually cute when you go and it starts to go in. Whoop! The head already appears. Now looking at this again, disclaimer, I don't I don't do stop motion, so I'm not gonna be able to give you any type of insightful technique it's more like i have questions given that this is like this right <clears throat> unless there's a light through this maybe i i don't see the you know any influence here on the light this shadow feels like it's been added wait 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 let's frame through it maybe faster than framing through it there you go so that i'm assuming added in post it looks a bit cut out and these are just added and this is just a an, a comped background in my limited knowledge of this whole setup, this is my guess. But I like the presentation, it's nice and clean. This all makes total sense. It's very catchy in terms of the colors. It's got a somewhat complementary colors there as well, right? Here, your red and the blue. And it's cute. Got a little slide going backwards. And there's not much else I can say. If I will, if it's, this was CG and I were looking at just regular timing stuff and contrast and stuff like that, I would probably say. When the creature here, this reminds me of my kids' show that I used to watch back then. Can't remember the name. When this falls down, it might be slower on the up and then go just to have more contrast in the timing. So it's not up, left, right, left, right, go. So it's these back and forth are not so even and repeated. Super picky. Not that they're extremely even. If I go... Oh, it's painful to watch me do this. This. Well, let's go over here. And then we have onion skinning. See, it's not completely even. There is a change. So there is contrast. But as a whole, I would love for it to be more. Like uh, Adam Driver would say, more! But it's... Something where, to me, even though the distance changes, as you can see there, I feel like with the timing, I see a speed up, but it just, it just feels still even. I know it's a weird comment to give, even though it has contrast and it does speed up. I would love for it to be pushed in terms of the contrast, where it, it's, you know, it might be painful, it might be disorienting to go the blah, 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 and then maybe even, what is he doing here? He doesn't overshoot, so it could be something like that so it'll overshoot there and then really slow and go back in there that could be something even on the back end maybe you could do something where you hold this for a bit longer and then you go up but well, then you go down first little squash up for a stretch stretch into it's almost a bit of a launch Again, technique-wise, you would have to have this something on a stick back there and then comp this out to not see it. I'm saying this because it would be cute to have this in the air. So it was like launching itself whip, into the hole there for this. That would kind of also give us the sense of speed, jumping up and then dropping into this, into that. Super picky. Again, uh, I always feel weird giving um, stop motion notes, but it's a, it's a cute clip. I like it. It's short and sweet. Critique short and sweet. That's all I have. And uh, yeah, I like that submission.